Alright guys, so in this video we're going to be playing some Swain ADC. Uh, in my opinion, it's pretty broken depending on who you're playing against bot lane and what support you has. This game I'm playing solo with uh, no friends on my team because it's pretty late at night and I'm trying to get this upload out. So the Tully is a first time Tully in mid. Uh, going against Sivir and Lulu bot lane, we're not going to be able to out out duel them in a in a two v two for sure. So we just gotta wait until I hit level six probably. Otherwise if we get behind in the game it's pro we're probably gonna lose. Hopefully this Nautilus doesn't just hard engage uh, level one or two because they have shields that'll just take away my abilities and Sivir's a pretty hard counter to swing bot lane. So it doesn't really matter if a Lowey gets fed. Uh, he also may be a problem. Uh, we'd always be able to come back later in the game if uh, Sivir gets a lot of kills, but Yasu and Graves are probably the only problem we have. Depending on how they do, we'll make the game easier or harder. So pretty much I'm just going to focus on farming uh, and just, just mainly poking when I can. I'm just not going to try and poke is my main thing because I, I really won't do any lot of damage. So we're going to want the wave to push towards us pretty much, so we're going to let them attack the farm because I'm not trying to uh, get ganked by Graves early because it won't, it won't do good. So as long as the wave keeps pushing towards our tower, that'll be good. Uh, I don't really care if I get that behind and farm, but I have to build Catalyst here in this situation because I just, if I buy uh, Blasting Wand, I won't out damage them. Because they'll just shield through my Blasting Wand damage and uh, I'll, I'll run out of mana. So in this situation, I'm going to get E uh, second because of Lulu. And if she decides to walk up, I'm just gonna hit her, uh, hit her with the E. So now we're gonna just gonna start uh, farming under towers. Oh shit! Yeah, this is why I bring teeth. My debt. Nice. That's pretty nice. So we're gonna pick up a relic shield here. And some health potions, because I was not expecting that from the Lulu. She did have ignite. That did suck. So now I just have to focus on coming back into the game. So they're trading one for one mid. Latulia said in jam selection doesn't know what she's doing, so I don't know why I just didn't dodge. But you should never blend the game on your teammates. We really ended this wave to push back towards us. Oh, since Graves is here, we see him. I don't know why she's pushing the wave that hard when their jungler is here. So we're just gonna push the wave in the tower and hope it bounces back to us. It's probably not going to.
And the reason getting Relic here is actually to heal you and your support, and when you ult and run into him, you still proc the Relic, so you will heal off of it if your support is near you. So it's just more increased healing. So we know Graves is near bot side, he could be in this bush right here. We just don't want to risk anything. Yep, there he is. Like I said. So we're going to have to back here. Or could we stand a tower? We do have Relic. Yeah, we could stand to the tower, we have Relic. Because Lulu doesn't have her uh, abilities. Thing we got the cannon too. Alright, it's not so bad actually staying under the tower right now. Alright, so I do have enough for my uh, catalyst, which I was hoping to get, so I'm just gonna back. There's no point in going wand here because they do have uh, more shields and damage than us. Oh. Well, I don't know how we stopped his back. That's weird. So Lulu had no ignite. At least Sivir's not getting the kills. That's the good thing. So when I hit level 6, we should be able to fight them. Uh, Lulu has no ignite. And if we all in, our our abilities should do a lot of damage. Even as Graves does gank us, we should be able to hold them off. Let's go ahead and ward the bush right here. We should just focus on poking them out a little by little. Now since I'm six, uh, if we do get an engage here, hopefully they push the tower or the wave like they are. Mm. Uh, yeah, so it's coming, bot. So we should get out. Yeah, so unsuccessful run by him. That was pretty good. So Tilly was able to go top, and hopefully she gets a kill. So I'm pretty much ready to go in. She spell shielded too. She has no spell shield, so we can go in on her if we wanted to. But I think we're just gonna play it safe. They're probably backing anyway. Oh no, they're not. Alright, so I'm probably just gonna go uh, back and TP. Uh, these minions may or may not see me. Alright, I got it. So we're gonna go ahead and TP. So 
So we have our blasting one now. We have a lot more damage. And we leveled up. So we are pretty pretty good. We're scaling up there now. This is pretty much how you want to play bot lane. Like you don't have to uh, do so good in the early game as Swain. So I don't know if anyone's in there. I'm ready to fight if he is, but I don't know if he wants to. Good, 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 good. That's good. Alright, so we got her. We should be able to get her too. Yeah. I have this healing, so... No! Oh, I got her! Alright, that's good, that's good, that's good. We was able to get her, so we got that. Now we're able to get cloth armor. <sighs> so I got two kills for one death. That, that was pretty good. So we are ahead of the sever. So we are ahead of the other ADC. We have one full completed item. So we are doing pretty good right now. Farm is okay. Uh, what's hurting us is pretty much the roams from them. Otherwise, we're winning the lane. And what I said is, uh, Lowey could do bad, uh, but Graves and Graves and Yasa were doing pretty good right now, so I don't know how we're going to have to come back from that. Hopefully they don't get this tower, because I really, uh, he got it. Really don't want to push by myself. He doesn't even have a full item. Okay. So we should just be able to push bot lane freely. Oh no, we actually have to rotate mid. But now the tower's gone. They're probably all gonna come down bot lane. So I should ask for assistance. Yeah, here they come. Where they going? Let's go. Let's converge on them. This is good. This is a good fight. Hopefully we catch the sever out somewhere right here. Yeah, get her. Oh, Nautilus. Oh, no. Alright, we killed him. That's good. Are they rotating down bot lane? If they're coming through the river, we can cut them off. Ah. Uh. Yeah, this game's looking better for us now. Uh, as you can tell, like, Swain early game farming, it's it's really hard. Uh, they they just outpoke you like every other other every comp. But when you when you scale after you get your rod, it's really good in the bot lane. So after I back, I'm gonna look into getting my boots and then maybe the stopwatch. Uh, they are actually all AD, so we're definitely going tabbies. Sivir's coming back down. She's probably gonna cue the wave or something. No spot of anyone on their team. We do have Diana down here, so that is good. So I'm gonna go ahead and try and bait something out. Hopefully he dashes in. All right, good. Good, good. If you get that knock up. Good, good, good. Good. We're tanking this really well. Good job. Oh, uh, the only bad thing is that he died. We did uh, all tank the, the tower really good, though. Yeah, so I'm probably just going to push out this wave and then back, depending on whatever, whatever else happens. Yeah. 1700 gold. Should be able to get our full boots, our stopwatch, and start our zonias. 
Uh, there we go, and we could sell our relic now in the game and get some AP instead. So now we're gonna look in pushing top. Uh, then we need Camille to go down bot. Because then our next primary objective is getting this top tower. Unless we do something mid. Because it looks like they're actually about to fight. So I'm going to head over there. Where we can get a pick top. It's either or. Whatever whatever works best. So let me put my hotkey really quick. You have to play off your team too. Like if you see the, all of them in one area. You should always play off of it. So I see Talia may get caught out. So I'm coming in. So we could fight this. Let's see. So now we're just going to pretty much have to hold the tower since three of our teammates died. I do have stopwatch, but... I hope this Nagaso knows his shit could block my abilities, but he's probably retarded. So we're running low on mana, so we're probably just going to have to go back. Uh, yeah. Pick up some more armor for the Zonius. And then we could TP in somewhere if we need to be, but we don't. So we're just gonna walk back mid lane. What should be happening is uh, me and Nalt should be top, and Camille has to be bot because she has TP. And I also have TP ready, so we could do that. What drag is this? That's an ocean. Uh, we wonder how me and Camille will do if they all come. So it looks like they're all doing ocean. Uh, we could TP in. Are we gonna go in this, guys? Or no? Yeah, I'm gonna TP in. Good, this may work out. Really good. Yeah. Got him. That's some good shit there. It was really good uh, that me and Camille teleported together. We were both on the same page. And the Alawi probably didn't have TP or anything, so... Of course, she just couldn't find a spot to teleport in, so we won that fight easily. Even though, I don't know who got the drag. Uh, we got the drag. But even if they got the drag, it just would have been worth for us, because we got way more kills. So somebody does have to answer to a Lowie, but it's not me. Somebody's gonna have to back. Uh, she won't get the tower. We'll be able to take this tower right here and then go back. I'll be able to zone anyone off that comes near us. Oh, she is gonna get it. That's bad. Looks like we may be able to catch her off though. Oh my god, that tornado was close as shit. So it looks like they're gonna find a pick on to a Lally, which is pretty good. Camille may die to her. Ooh, lucky. So now we're just focused on farming up and getting our next items, and if our team wants to start a fight, I'm fine with that. Because I am pretty fed right now. And I don't want to finish my Zonias right now because I have not uh, taken full use of my stopwatch. I'll be able to use it and then use it again. That's one thing you got to watch out for, is you're not taking full use. So I'm not going to get my Zonias. I'm going to get the items that upgrade into it. But I'm going to start working on my next item. Which will, mm, they're all AD, you may be thinking uh, Spirit Massage, but they have a lot of crit. 
Huh. Maybe in this one occasion I will have to go randomins, but I'm not thinking about it. So we're just going to have to go back in and not get our zonias yet. Alright, so team's getting caught out. We're actually going to fight here. Uh, it's a pretty good fight. I need to get that right there. So I get the... Yep. Stun sever, hopefully. Oh, no. Too much movement speed. Didn't account for it. Yeah, they're both out of there. It's good that we got a pick, though. Hopefully I get that. Got it. We need Baron Vision, too. I'm coming. Ooh, caught out the saber. Good. So if we get her, okay. We're coming for the graves now. Good, good, good. Uh, can we take Baron off that? Yes. Maybe. I don't know if we can or not. Uh, do we have the damage right now? We don't know if it, we, they have it warded, so I don't think it's worth it. Allowing maybe up. Oh, it's not warded. Nautilus DC'd. Nice. Hmm. Don't do some stupid shit. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead. We can get our. Uh, no, I don't want to get it yet. Get our uh, rod. Or actually, we're gonna go death cap. There's no point in getting spirit massage because we are pretty ahead right now. So we're gonna go death cap before uh, before spirit massage, since we're ahead. Like I say in my build on Mobifier, you have to. Uh, Get the death cap if you're ahead, and if you're behind, you gotta get the spirit massage so you scale in the late game better. Because when you're ahead, you can game, uh, end the game faster if you buy more AP. And I'm actually a level advantage to all of them besides Alawi and Graves. So at this point in the game, you need to focus vision all around Baron. So we see that two of them are bot. Uh, Graves and Sivir are bot. Three of them are around mid lane. None of them are near top lane, I would say. Maybe Alawi. So it looks like we're actually fighting mid too. So Gra if Graves does show bot, we could take Baron. If they get another pick on the Lulu. So did Graves show bot? Yeah, they're all bot. I may have to TP in. Uh, it's not up. I'm gonna have to answer to a Lowy, actually. That's the one thing that sucks. Lowy's uh, 0 4 but she is still useful to them. I'm gonna be able to kill her though. I should be able to. get some healing off. And one thing with playing Swain too is if you run to the minions, uh, you get more healing. So if you just run to the enemy minions, it's better. So the more you run around, uh, you may think that running back to your tower may be a good thing, but in other instances, if the lane is coming, let's say right here, uh, you want to run towards the lane uh, because you get extra healing from your alt through minions and running away only heals you once per the champion. But if you have five minions you're healing off of from two, you're also gonna get the extra like 100 healing per second from those. So they're about to fight again. Uh, I don't have ult, so I'm just gonna back really quick, and that is an infernal, so my TP is up. So I'm gonna walk back top lane probably, uh, and if they do start a fight, we are gonna get that. So, I actually need item space now, so we are going to get our Zonias. And that, they did start a fight. Do they need me though? No, they don't. So they could probably get the Infernal though. I'm just going to walk down uh, mid lane now, because Baron and Dragon are up, and team is mid lane. So I don't really want to be off by myself and getting caught out. I'm going to stay with them in this situation, because if we do get another pick, we could all run to Baron. And I won't have to waste my TP for it. Oh, that's nice, nice. We got him. Yeah. Alright. So we could go Baron, we could rush it, but I don't think we have the damage with our team. Camille's actually doing a good job because she has TP up. I'm 
to fight this. I do have my uh, stopwatch up. Me and Diana are coming through the back, so we're going to hit that. Oh, our, our ult's still going. Oh, that's lucky. Got her. Yes, good shit, team. Good shit. So I'm gonna be able to get my death cap now because of that fight, and that's why you don't. That's why you don't opt for the spirit visage. If I opt for, for the spirit visage, I wasn't able to do enough damage in that fight. Since I was ahead, I had more damage. So now we're gonna get this, and then we're gonna work towards our uh, our spirit visage. And after we get that, we'll pretty much be unstoppable. And you may be thinking they're all AD. Why get spirit visage? You get that 30% increased healing. The health helps too. And then the final item, we may get Dead Man's uh, Plate or Lee Andrews, depending on what time in the game it is. So now we just have to focus on Baron, pretty much. So, uh, she has TP down, so she has to be with the team. We could look to get a pick, but will it work? I don't know. They don't have that worded. We could just go to Baron, but... We gotta pick on her. Oh. Yeah, my zone is isn't up, so I'm gonna have to back. Damn, yeah, she's actually doing a lot of damage. Damn. All right. Yeah, we we are gonna opt in for some more armor. Yeah. All right. We are low health, so we gotta watch out. And we got her. Haha, <laughs> and that probably will be game, guys. Yeah. You just run. Run down here, because the wave's already at the tower. Ah, uh, I don't think we better end it. We should be able to get two inhibs, though. Two inhibs back, and then go Baron. Yeah, so we have to get out. This could be a throw really fast. Yeah. They may be... Oh. They surrendered. Alright, so that's going to be it for this gameplay, guys. If you guys did enjoy, be sure to subscribe if you liked the video. Uh, any suggestions uh, about me and this recording, let me know in the comments. And thanks for watching, guys.